All right, hello everybody. Welcome to Miss Valley Gaming. My name is Dread. It's a live stream. Thanks in advance to everyone who tunes in for the live stream. We appreciate it. If you're watching this afterwards on video form. Hello. What can I tell you? Miss Valley Gaming, we do all kinds of gaming here, but we concentrate a lot on survival games and fantasy games. Um, RPGs and that sort of thing. Uh, Wild West Dynasty. Have you heard of Wild West Dynasty? Maybe you're interested in it. Maybe that's why you stopped by. What can I tell you about it? Let's be honest, not a lot. I've seen about 15 minutes of gameplay a couple of days ago. That was enough for me to purchase the game. Everything that I have knowledge in other than that is just from reading the manuals that came with the game. Uh, uh, actually, reading the manuals that I purchased as part of the DLC with the game. I believe. Anyways, um, I have not played it myself. The only thing I've done so far is go into the settings um, and, and messed around in that very, very briefly, just with my uh, my window gameplay setting to get it proper and uh, turning off the music so I don't get uh, copyright strikes. Oh, YouTube and your wonderful and wacky copyright strikes. All right, so uh, I hear there's wonderful music for this game. There's even a soundtrack that you can get for the game. Um, you ain't gonna hear any of that here, sorry. So, what are we planning on doing? We're planning on hopping into this game. Here's what I can tell you about Wild West Dynasty. It is a survival game. It does have quests to it, and it is also a city or town building game. So, you will recruit settlers and put them to work, build up the town building by building, unlocking those buildings as you go through quests, I believe, etc., etc., and then you've got to keep, keep your villagers fed, healthy, producing what you need. Uh, not having people starve, all of that kind of stuff. But to start out, it's going to be more, I believe, just you alone, because you're not going to have built anything or done anything yet. And, um, hey, I, I that's all I really know about the game. So uh, if you're expecting a great, awesome gameplay and wonderful tips, um, I'm going to tell you, I, I probably don't have either of those, let's be honest. You and I are going to be experiencing this game together uh, for me for the very first time maybe for you for the first time as well uh, again you know I just encourage you uh, relax have fun uh, gaming should be fun and in my opinion gaming is meant to be taken at a nice slow pace and enjoyed so uh, if you're ready come along with me and we're going to get started on this here game here's our screen Wild West Dynasty. That's actually a very beautiful loading screen. I, I could have gone with that for my opener, but uh, hey, when you've got AI art available on the internet, take advantage of it, right? The, the answer to that is yes. Yes, Dread, take advantage of that. Oh, yeah. Okay, so um, I'm guessing we're uh, we're going to uh, go with new game, and we're going to um, lazily and with great enjoyment stumble our way through figuring this game out. Let's. I'll, I'll show you the settings. I'll show you the settings. There's controller settings, I guess, over here. There's audio settings. There's uh, graphics settings. I got mine a maximized window. It had exclusive window, which meant every time I clicked on my second screen, it dropped my game off my first screen, which I didn't like. So I put it to maximized window. Works better for me. And uh, gameplay stuff. Blah blah blah. Left the tooltips on. I don't even know what adventure mode is. It doesn't tell me. So I didn't touch that. Let's, uh, let's start a new game and see what happens. Ooh, beautiful loading screen. It's very nice looking. I'm guessing this is a solo dev game, by the way. So um, you can expect bugs. You can expect it to still be worked on. I think it's been around in early access for a while, but I believe now it's out of early access. I'm not even sure on that. It's available on Steam. Check it out yourself. But it's it's not finished. It's a work in progress. There will be issues with it. That's just life. You're expecting a triple A polished complete game. You're not gonna find it. Hopefully what you'll find here is something that's fun and something you either want to watch and or play yourself. 
This would be a great time to have some music going, wouldn't it? Because, you know, we're waiting for it to load. And probably normally there'd be some wonderful Old West music playing. No, no. No, no. YouTube will have none of that stuff. No, 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 no. Okay, we've got sound. I, like, I do like the loading screen. When you travel together oh. for weeks and months, you get to know the people you travel with. Makes you grow closer. Makes you suspicious, even of those meant to guide you. Especially of those meant to guide you. Hey, stop! Where's it going? Alan? Traitor. Damn, I had a bad feeling about you from the start. Where did you go? Why now? Is this an ambush? Are you giving back up? Or are you just letting the storm do the dirty work for you? This not seems. Animations are decent looking at them. Hit them. I don't know what they can but... Shit. A lot of wolves. That's interesting. They're gonna, uh, they're gonna load into the game. We don't have to push the skip spacebar button. Yep. Apparently. Okay. If we, uh, whoa, a little bit of jank there. Can we see our character? No, we can't turn towards our character. It is only third person, by the way, I do believe. So we have to approach the fire. Or anything over this way to take a quick look. Dead wolf. Can we do anything with it? Thought I saw something for a moment there. Nope. Can't do anything with the wolf. Okay. Got, uh, oh, stone deposit. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Got a little bit of a little bit of jank to it, a little bit of stutter. Yeah, actually a fair amount of stutter. Hmm. Keep stuttering. Just what the frame rate is. I don't have any of that up, so I don't know. As you can see, uh, we've got um, poor health, and we are freezing. I pick this up. Oh, let me pick this up. It will. Sticks and stones, yep. Oh, deer over there? Wow, look at that deer. Beautiful. I don't want to take too long because it says our character's freezing, so. I do want to grab a few things because that's the basis of survival games, right? Pick stuff up. Can I, uh, can I find anything here? quick like anything here anything in these boxes anything in these can I zoom in there we go nothing here there is no boxes okay can't take the saw blade or anything nope character is definitely freezing okay grab a few more sticks and things the fire will burn out I need more sticks Got a lot of sticks, actually, buddy. I actually anticipated needing sticks, and I've got a bunch. Ooh. Take that. Yeah. Okay, let's uh, analyze? Okay, so analyzing revolves around kind of turning things.
carefully analyzed, okay? You need uh, seven sticks and three stones. Pretty sure we have that. Um, light rekindle. You unlocked a recipe torch. Collect sticks. Yeah, add sticks. Craft a torch and equip it in your inventory. Okay, so we go to B for the build craft menu. Crafting. I'm guessing tools, or maybe we could try. Well, let's try tools. Yes, torch. And equip it in your inventory. Okay. Is it our it's I for inventory? We've got our hammer here, our torch. I guess we'll. Uh, oh, can we, uh, Fortune number two. Check the well for water and drink. Is there anything in this building? Probably get our torch uh, out. Oh, some bottles here. Nope, can't take those. Can't go in the building. Okay. Look for anything? Nice. Taking this one. Even while freezing death, people, it uh, pays to look around. Go to the well. Which is over here. Okay. Take that hoe. I don't mean that in a you know, rap video way either. Hey, Super Boo, how you doing? Hey, hey, been a while since I got you live. How are things rolling? Hey, they are they are rolling right along, right along. Uh, I've had some health issues this year, you know, but uh, still do, I guess. But, you know, it's hard to complain. One is alive, so you know how it is. But uh, checking out some Wild West Dynasty. Thanks for uh, coming on by. So we want a drink. We don't have a canteen. No, we do have a canteen. We don't have a canteen. We don't have a bucket. Okay. I don't know how much we're supposed to drink. Drink a lot. Survival sense to highlight important nearby items. So. Okay. Stones. A bucket? Can I take that bucket? No? Ow. Canteen. Take it. And it's full. Alright, what else we got? Search the ruins for food. Probably a good idea. I think I've been doing that, actually. Uh, why is this high? Oh, I could take these planks. Oh. Holding down the middle mouse button here so I can see anything of interest. A little bit of... Whoa. Okay, what happened? Yeah, we stopped moving. And... Alright, that was weird. We did it again. Alright. You're getting something that causes everything to stop. 
That's weird. Grab as much of this stuff as I can. I'm sure we probably got carry weight stuff. So 47 out of 200 kilograms. Yeah, we gotta be careful. That's to be careful what we pick up. There's a quicker way to do this, but I'm not sure there is. Big ball? Okay. It says a mount one. And maybe just a, a little bit janky, I think. A little bit janky. But, you know... Of sticks and rocks mainly here. Probably grab some more planks. Oh, I see like an axe here. Oh, well, we do have first person. Oh. Okay, it's really hard to see with the torch, but okay. Interact with the box. Okay, so Dick, there's four of them. Can I can I can I do like four? No. Can they be take them all? No, there's a take all button. Okay. I'll just use the take all button. This makes a lot more sense. They're closed. That's that. So I'm missing something, which it could be. I don't know. Am I supposed to use the axe on them? Oh, no. I'm not sure. something from your inventory. Let's go back by the fire. Uh, we should be able to uh, shift to run. Yeah. Plank with stuff over here. Grab that. Stand by the fire. We're going to eat something. Got some raw meat. Hey, can we cook? Should we cook something? Okay, is it cooking? It's cooked. Eat a tank. Alright. So we should be able to go into inventory. Food. It says, okay, that was raw. This one's cooked. And just push E to eat. Yes. Find shelter. Recipe unlocked wooden hammer. Uh, B menu. Tools. Make one of these. Crafting it while kneeling in the fire. Probably not a great idea, but all right. Repair buildings and build new ones. Okay. So cool, cool. Find the damaged walls. I 
I don't know what that means. Somebody has already started repairing this. Put a hammer in your inventory and repair the damage. Okay. Uh, is that our hammer there, number one? I think I have to swing it, don't I? Yes. Okay, is there any more damaged walls? I think this is our first little hole. Up in there. This over here. Pretty cool. I don't mind this. Open your journal. J for journal? All right. Our guide deserted us when we need him most. Is he a coward or a traitor? I will only find out if I survive the night. Enter the house. Oh. Nope. Oh, you just push in. Okay. Read Ada's letter in your inventory. In here? Nothing. Pants. I think, were we not wearing pants before? We are wearing pants. Huh. Um. We got pants and pants. Uh huh? These pants are uh, no heat protection at all. How about these ones? No heat protection. They have cold protection. They're basically the same, so that's fine. Okay, everything else is cool. Um, inventory, read Ada's letter. The under journal? No. Ada's letter. There it is. A eatery. Dear John, apparently our character is named John. A little disappointed we didn't get to choose a character and make a character, but that's okay. Uh, I told you to open this letter only once you had arrived. The way I know you, you are reading this on the ship or on the back of a wagon. Oh, so we came from overseas. That is the case, I'm glad. It means that your journey has been uneventful and peaceful so far. Yeah, not really. I couldn't ask for more other than being there with you right now. I will do my best to look after your mother for you, but I hated to let you and Paul go alone, and I can't wait to join you. The things they say about this country, lush, green forests filled with game, crystal clear waters that you can even find gold in. Can you believe it? Fertile ground as far as the eye can see, and an endless sky. People from all over the world and some nobody has ever even met before. What an adventure it must be. But forgive me. But John, many say it's very dangerous too. Please be careful. Keep an eye on your brother. If there's anything I can do, even from a distance, let me know. I will find a way. I love you, Ada. Okay, so... It says Ryder. So our name is John Ryder. Uh, our love interest is Ada. And our brother is Paul. Interesting. Now it says go to sleep. So there's nothing else in here. Nope. Can we interact with the fire? Should we light the fire? Seems like a good idea. Interact with the bookshelf? Nope. So we're going to simple bet, interact with that, and we're sleeping through the night, I guess. Excellent. It's interesting. I should wait until evening. Well, what time is it? I don't know. Um, so leave the house is the only part of that to do. Okay. Pick up any of that stuff, eh? 
Oh. Didn't expect a cutscene. Hey, who's that? Who is she? You might want to look over to your right there, John. John Ryder. Cutscenes are very loud. Let me know if you find the cutscenes loud. I could try to adjust the volume. My headphones are kind of brutal at times. Her name is Owl. Careless Settler is a dead settler. Nice. We need to say, is that a threat or I mean no? Let's go with I mean no harm. You are careless. You eat food you find lying around. You sleep when you know a stranger is nearby. Between starving and freezing to death, I took my chances. Who are you? I'm Ryder. For you, Owl. That's a strange name. That's kind of rude to say. My father gave it to me. He was a strange man like you. Oh, she sees us as her father figure already. Um, Owl, I lost my people in the snowstorm. I lost my brother Paul. Have you seen anyone else besides me? Look around. This was a city once. Many died in the fire. They shouldn't have stepped in the campfire then. Uh, the others fled and made camp on the other side of the hills. People you came with. You walked in circles during the storm. Your wagons are not far. I have to go find them. Wait, you are hurt. You are cold. Take this. Oh, thank you. What did I get? Black poncho. So let's put the poncho on. Am I supposed to do that? Try. Is it going to take off my jacket? Nope. Just an extra thing. If we put the field hat on as well. We should put the field hat on. Yeah. Looks terrible. We should do it anyways. Yep. I just did that. Thank you. Okay. Analyze and axe. How do I do the analyzing thing again? I don't remember already. Oh boy. Axe, axe, axe. Don't act. Analyze. Yeah. So it's about rotating it and, and, and doing that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, that's it. Craft two axes. Why does it want me to craft two more axes? I don't know. I don't really know. We're just going to do it. Demolish buildings, cut down trees. do it again. Yes, yes we do. Bada bing bada boom. Cut down trees it says. First of all, I'd like to see is there anything else uh, we can make right here? Okay. Cut down some trees. Axe is number four? Like these kind of trees? say no. Tree, uh, tree chopping is nice. You can complain about there. That's good.
guess he wanted me to pick up the trees and stuff as well, right? Mushroom. Hey, cool. Small tree? Does that count? I think I may not. I don't know. Some of that disappeared into the ground. Okay. Definitely gonna need one more tree. Yep, yeah, definitely. Definitely one more. Yep. Yeah. Oh, we can just take this one. Nice. I can tell I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this game. Collect logs. I need one more log. Uh oh. Did I miss a log somewhere? I don't know. Do I have to talk about another tree to get another log? Probably. Dang it. So. I also recently bought Lumberjack's Dynasty. Which I hear is extremely janky, but still, could be some fun. Craft a wooden hammer. Haven't we already done that? We already have a wooden hammer. I have to craft another one? I'm not sure. Alright, we'll do it anyways. Telling us to. Place a tent. Why do I place a tent? I mean... What if those wolves are still up there, those wolf carcasses and stuff? Can I get something like this? No? Is this where we came down from? I think it is. Let's go take a look. Overburdened. Oh, we totally are. We can't run or anything right now. It sucks. There should be two wolf carcasses up here. I'm still picking stuff up. Or was that only in the cutscenes? It's still also the cutscene. No, no. Okay. Yep, here they are. Oh, come on. What? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, no, wait. What was that? What? Oh, that's the stone deposit. Dang it. I can't, I can't do anything with these wolves? It's kind of disappointing. Can't, can't. Let's take a look at the map. Okay, so maps are interesting. Um... This is where we're at. Um, is there a way to switch the map somehow? No? Oh, it's at Wesco. Is that where our caravan is? No. Me? I put something here? Did I put a tracker here or anything? Man, I don't seem to be able to. Oh, and here you check, you click on this, you get the water map. The darker the blue, the more groundwater there is. You want to build where there's groundwater. Okay, so I want to go back this way. I'd like to... All right, is there... Does it show up on my map? Yes, it does. I need to put it on Okay. So, it says to place a tent. But I'm wondering if we shouldn't do that when we find the camp. So here's what I'm thinking. Let's 
take a look at our our little lines down here by the, on the bottom left here. So we've clearly got health, heat and cold, food, water, and we've got another one that I don't understand. So I don't know what that means. We've also got something that's locked. Maybe that's the locked one. I don't know. I'd like to go into the building that we repaired here and use the storage and store some things. I think that's a good idea. I really kind of wish we could have taken the house going. Because we're clearly carrying too much. I mean, we could walk all the way to where our people are, but if we can't store anything there, we're just going to be overburdened there as well. That sucks. Well, why don't you light the fire? It would probably help you a lot. Well, let's interact with the chests. And what are we going to put in here? Half the logs in there. Put a few stones in there. And oh my goodness, we have 76 sticks. Probably a few too many. <laughs> um, is that going to help us now? Down to 87. That, that's, a, that's a help, yes. Now we can actually jog and stuff, so that's good. a little bit of this. Okay. Well, run. So, which way should we take to get there? I don't really know. I'm guessing left. Is there a save function? There is a save function. Let's save our game. All right. Oh, right over here. Just anything? an arrow there, but I can't see if it says anything. Probably does, but I can't read it. Are these old western people and their terrible writing? Pick up more stones and sticks, Grid, because you really, really need that. Saddle? So that was heavy. We got a horse over here. Oh, we got dead people. Tim! Oh, Tim! You fought? Who did you fight? Who, Tim? Tell me, Tim! Tim, why are you not talking to me? Damn you, Tim. You are so lazy. Tim! Do that? Can I crouch? No. Oh no, it's Perry! Perry, shit! That was no accident. This was not the storm. That was a bullet. Clean shot. Don't know what else I said because it went away too fast. Okay. Elegant hat. Nice! Where's that elegant hat? Give it to me. How's it different than my field hat? My field hat. As cold protection 1.5, heat protection 1.5, elegant hat is the same. Better condition? No, same. I put it on. Let's see. Oh, it's much nicer. Fuck you, Barry. Um. <laughs> hey, Owen. What's up, buddy? I swore I'd break your neck one day. Damn, not like this. 
damn, Owen. Damn. Oh, no, Nelly. Not sweet, Nelly. She cooked the best chicken and rice. Nelly, little Nelly, no, 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 damn it, no. This is some great writing. Holy crap, is it ever done. Take the stick, I'm gonna beat this horse to death with it. How dare that horse shoot all, shoot all my people? Why did you do it? Inspect horse. Horse's name is Orion. Horse is a crack shot with a pistol. Oh, I'm kidding. Um, what else can we take a look at? We examined everything we need out of the wooden hammer. Yep. Okay. And the stone axe, has that been all analyzed? Yes, because we can't analyze it anymore. Hammer. Oh? Oh, don't speak so badly about Nelly. Or Nettie, or whatever the hell her name was. I don't know. I'm kidding. Speak as badly about her as you want. Analyze the torch, right? We have not analyzed it. <laughs> Stone X? Everything's done there. Okay. And can we analyze like our clothing and stuff? Okay for food and water and shit? Yep. Interact. Hey, are we continuing this way? I think we are. Can we still use middle mouse button on the horse? I don't think we can. Paul's jacket. Oh no, Paul! No sign of Paul. Paul, where is Paul? Where is he, brother? Why did you leave your jacket? That's important. Where is it? Where's the health bar? Where'd it go? Um. Can I analyze the canteen? I can. We should analyze as many things as we possibly can. Gives us recipes and whatnot, right? Sometimes. Um, log. No. Plank. Analyze the plank. What next? Uh, just want to analyze stone or stick? Nope. Uh, we are looking at the canteen. Yep. Um, so we can't analyze this stuff. Nope. Paul's jacket. Miner's pickaxe. Uh, do I have a pickaxe here already? Okay, now, yes. Still okay for food and water.
Come along, Orion. have infinite stamina? Not sure. Hey. This looks like our place. Here. Oh. Yo, Susan. 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 They just wander around, oh boy. Can't catch her because, you know, she just walks faster than me, apparently. <laughs> wow. Ew. He can't do this to us. What are you talking about? And what do you want? Pleasure to meet you too. Deputy Aaron Reeve, now move along. What is this about? Right, you aren't one of them. Let's make this quick. They have no right to stay in this land. It belongs to Mr. Chapman and to some Mr. Ryder who unfortunately never made it here. Hey, that's me. I'm Ryder. All right, most of the land still belongs to Mr. Chapman and all of it is under the sheriff's protection. Who are they? Refugees from Paradise that burned down village not far from here. Well, it was Paradise. Now it's Ghost Town. If you're Ryder, that's your land. Congratulations. Why do they have to leave now? The longer they stay, the harder it will be to make them leave and the more damage they will do to these pastures. What happened? They claim that Ghost Riders came down from the sky and set everything ablaze. Now the ground is cursed and they occupy land that is not theirs. How are they supposed to move somewhere else if they have so little left? isn't our problem. So you speak for Mr. Chapman? In his absence, the Sheriff's Office is tasked with protecting his rights and property. When is he expected to return? He has business elsewhere and rarely visits. I suppose that is why I arrived to find a city built and burned down on my land, land which I bought from Mr. Chapman and which you are protecting. What are you implying? Just an observation, these pastures are not actually being used, are they? Mr. Chapman owns a lot of land. Wasteland, but with a lot of potential. Maybe it should be put to the use. And you are suggesting? Let these people pay for staying as soon as they can rebuild and bring in a decent harvest. <coughs> Excuse me. Fear of profits from us, and I doubt Mr. Chapman will disagree take years. Give them five. They haven't paid a small fee before. I don't see them paying an even bigger one now. I will help them, and they will pay. As will you if you stay here, no matter if you settle on your land or prefer to move elsewhere as well. Is that a threat? Friendly reminder, five years to settle, and then you pay yearly. Otherwise, you won't have the sheriff's protection. That is not something you want to lose out here. Well, I'm a man of honor. We'll see you about that. Goodbye for now, and welcome to the West. Yeah, 
I gotta talk to Hank as well. I'm supposed to place a tent too. Am I supposed to place a tent out here? I don't know. Let's just uh, walk towards town. This is you want to call it town. Get on my horse. Let's ride towards town. Sells a tent. Right about. Keep her built. Yep. Nope. Got a tent. Uh, that's a tent. Cool, that's done. Now let's go and build a little campfire down here too, just because we can. There. Okay. And it says place hair traps. Super interesting stuff. Super interesting. From my tent! I should probably get you out of the road, eh? Congratulations, Orion. This is now your stable. You're welcome. So, can I do anything with the tent? Interact? I can sleep if I want, and that's it. Okay. Oh, cool. Um, hair traps. Just gonna place them over here, I guess. I don't know. Let's uh, let's start building some and see. Right. Okay. I'm put another one over here. Kind of look like rocks. We're right back here. Okay. Hopefully we can catch ourselves some bunny rabbits. Now what? Where the hell is Hank? Only carrying. Oh, I, 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 I could still, I could run a little bit. Okay. Ain't this guy over here? I've overheard everything. Thank you. You just saved all these lives. Thank you. That guy's got his age. Hot Hank, age 48. <laughs> Hi, I'm John Ryder. Each unknown. Uh, says you are their leader. Somebody had to be. I'm Hank. Pleasure to meet you. Uh, Ryder, I didn't mean to get involved, but... Can you please tell your women to stop walking in front of me and through my tent? I'm just saying. I'm saying I'm going to snap on somebody. I'm going to go all red dead on somebody here. Uh, we are glad you did. We have lost so much overnight. Homes, belongings, supplies, animals, friends, and family. Your animals were friends and family. Does that mean some of you married your animals? Is that the kind of thing we got going on here, Hank? Should I be worried? Should I be concerned when I hear screams and bleeding in the middle of the night? Ble ble bleating, not bleeding. You don't hear bleeding usually. Uh, you just showed us the first glimmer of hope in quite some time. What would you name our new town? Hope. Uh... Hold on to it. You have a few tough years ahead of you. Then you turn 50. <laughs> uh, we will. Did you arrive with the last convoy? 
We got separated. I'm looking for my brother Paul. A few years younger than me. Similar height. He's got a name just like me, but mine's five letters and his is four. You can't miss him. I met a young man during the storm, but no telling it was your brother. Didn't give his name and he had a scarf in front of his face. Oh! Oh, Hank! Was it a lie little pony scarf? Hank always wears that. Wait, you're Hank. Never mind. Paul. Hank, no. Screw it. What else? He was wounded, but he refused to stay. He seemed nervous, took my spare coat, and when I got returned from getting some bandages, he was gone. A likely story. You killed him. Must have been him. I have to find him. Storm has covered all tracks and probably his corpse. He's alive. I know it, but I need weapons and provisions. Maybe a guide. What about Owl? I'm afraid we can't offer much of that. Fuck you, Hank. Okay. Uh, look at us. We... <laughs> Go back to your sheep fucking, Hank. Oh, sorry. Uh, my apologies. That's my inside voice. Uh, look at us. We gathered as much as we could from the ruins, and we forage and hunt as much as the snow permits. But the winter storms and wild animals keep claiming their share. Damn you, winter storms. Uh, I imagine a light tent must doesn't offer much protection. We have just celebrated the construction of a new warehouse. That's the irony of it all. The architect came all the way from the coast. It was a big event. And he sits over there by the campfire and has barely spoken a word since. Probably busy thinking of all the places he'd rather be. Poor house. Uh, <laughs> with the weather as it is, he'll be stuck with us for a while longer. Eh, I can imagine a worse fate. You're lucky you showed up at the right moment, Ryder. Our hospitality isn't exactly legendary, but we have each other's backs. You can help us secure our supplies. I can free up the men to help with the search for your brother. In other words, do a big job for me, and in a couple of weeks when it's over, we'll look for your dead brother in the snow. I hate this guy already. Uh, sounds good. See if your architect will speak to me. Before anything else, get some warm soup. Mama J just made some for everybody. I will take care. I'm a J. I'm a J. And there, I'm taking all that. Ah. Can I have this bucket. I want the. I want the bucket. Give me your bucket. Am I supposed to look up a horse here? I need a hitching post. I get fine things like I can never have nice things. The Undertaker? Yep, warmed over. Hello, Mama Jake. You are a stranger, yet you stood up to Reeve for us. Uh, who's Reeve? Is that Hank? Uh, no, Hank's the. I, I don't know. How much of a hero, I'm afraid, ma'am. I'm cold and hungry. Just happen to have the right words in the right moment. It saved our lives, and even heroes get cold and hungry. It's just not talked about that often. Here, this will help. Thank you, ma'am. How you doing? Thanks for asking. Anything else I can help you with? Learn more. Wondering what your story... Well, no. I have to find my brother. Have you seen him? Sorry, my dear. You're the first stranger I've met recently. Wonder what your story might be. Very minor compared to those of others. I live, I am known for my cooking, and one day I will die. Oh, you are more than that. I married an extraordinary man. In a different life, he would have had many children. Instead, I now have all of you. Who was your husband? He was an explorer. We married before he left with the Great Expedition. I was still very young, and so I did not worry. He was such a big man. I thought nothing truly bad could happen to him. Something bad did happen, didn't it, Mama J? You cooked and ate him. Oh. Uh, I only saw him briefly after his return. He was a slave and so was I. He was not allowed to leave his master despite everything he had done and I was forced to move elsewhere. I'm sorry. It was not your doing. No, but I want to believe he is happy now. I've heard stories that he might have joined one of the tribes in the mountains. What about you? I live and I am known for my cooking and sometimes I meet somebody new. What's your opinion on the sheriff? He has never visited us, and we never talk. My opinion can only ever be of Mr. Reeve, who sometimes forgets that he is not the sheriff. Uh, 
All right. I don't know who you are. Uh, what do I have to do now? Things? Things and stuff? Find the architect. I'm guessing it's this guy over here because it's pointing in this direction. Any of this stuff? Jordan V. Grand. A lot of talking in this game. I mean, as you can see, there's there's quests, there's you know, there's, there's survival. There's obviously going to be a lot of building and management going forward, that kind of thing. There's a there's a lot to this game. A lot to it. We have only just scratched the surface. Here we are. What now? We're at seven minutes in. Good day, sir. Leave me be, you uncivilized white. Ah, finally, a sensible person. You look just like your late grandfather. Give me your hat, your gold, and your food, or I will shoot you full of holes. Uh, uh, you knew my grandfather? Yes, yes, I have read everything the papers say about him. A truly great man. Such a shame that you sold much of the company, but I realize now why. No truth to the bankruptcy rumors. Moving to the new continent, you are true entrepreneurs. My name is Grand Gordon B. Grand. Heard you're an architect. You heard about me. Of course you've heard about me. Adventure, architect, and philosopher. I should be working for you, not for these down-to-earth people. Don't bite the hand that feeds you. Oh, I'm staying out of compassion. I will be the shining light in this darkness. You must notice that the settlers are struggling to secure their supplies. What? No. Are they? They need your expertise. I'm sure they will show their gratitude accordingly. I already designed the perfect modern warehouse. The heart of a city. A true jewel of the West. It offers storage, camps with food, water and material distribution, and it could be a safe haven for wagon transports. You could see it from miles away with its big yellow golden arches. I call it McGordon's. Oh. So you built one once, you could build it again. Uh, what? No! Why not? I may have lost the plans, but you can find them. I'm certain you can. Lost? It was an unfortunate misunderstanding with a rather unsavory gentleman. You were robbed. That is such a strong word. Yes. All right. Where do I find this unsavory gentleman? Probably at a local casino. First, take this rifle. What bullet? One bullet, my young son, can make all the difference in the world. Now, hand me your map. So, somewhere around here. And off you go. Mm hmm. Rifle, cartridge, and rifle. Number eight. Okay. Now we have to go and find the guy. Horsey! Oh, goodness. We are over there to dig in. Oh, a little bit. Let's, uh, let's eat some food. Eat a can of beans. And a drink of water. Our canteen's empty.
Whoa! Um, Orion? What you doing there, buddy?